Hi, I'm Katie Scheuer, Head of Learning Experience at Workplaceless, and I'm excited to introduce you to virtual leadership training and answer some of the most commonly asked questions we receive about these programs. Some of you might be thinking, I've been working remotely and leading remotely for a couple of years now. Why do I need training? What new skills can I learn? Well, first, teams coped over the past couple of years while working from home. They didn't have the bandwidth to focus on sustainable behaviors. Second, even after working remotely for two years, studies show that leaders are unequipped to lead remotely. Teams now have an opportunity to refine and improve their skills and develop sustainable behaviors. When all levels of leadership are aligned, teams achieve accelerated success from recently promoted or newly hired managers through mid-level leaders to executives, all leaders must recognize the mindset, infrastructure, and capabilities needed for effective remote work. We know that prepared and well-equipped digital leaders are essential to the success of teams. When leaders are trained for virtual environments, there's a ripple effect on positive results throughout the organization, including communicating and collaborating across distance, managing performance across distance, and maintaining productivity across distance. Different from general skills training, remote work and virtual leadership training uniquely focuses on the tactical skills that have proven to be essential for hybrid and fully remote teams. Upon completing a proven digital first leadership program like Lead Placeless, your leaders will know how to leverage async first work practices to address burnout and embrace flexibility, equip your employees to respond to future workplace dynamics and prevent inequity across hybrid teams. Let me walk you through Lead Placeless, our flagship virtual leadership program. The Lead Placeless program comprises three components, the asynchronous e-course, asynchronous projects, and synchronous project debriefs. And the reason we combine these three learning formats is first to introduce foundational knowledge within the e-course, second, to practice the application of skills through projects, and third, to build impactful behavior change and relationships. Let's start with the self-paced e-course. Here, leaders will focus on learning and applying the seven key skills of digital first leadership for remote and hybrid teams. Meetings, performance, connections, tools, boundaries, autonomy, and decisions. Each of these modules includes an example story of how the topic applies to remote and hybrid leadership, questions to evaluate your mindset on each topic, steps to build the capabilities to cultivate a remote first approach, How to develop the infrastructure to reinforce this skill on your team with templates and scripts. This e-course can be set up for your team within our matrix learning management system, or we can host on your company's LMS. Now let's explore an example of a project. Within the conclusion of the e-course is a complete toolkit that includes the templates and scripts to help build the infrastructure for each of the skills learned. These are the projects that every leader can prioritize and complete at their own pace, unless your organization has opted to include project debriefs, which we'll discuss in a moment. Our most popular projects include blended meetings, boundary scripts, and connection rituals. The flow involves similar steps for each project. For example, if you selected blended meetings as your project, you'd first identify an upcoming meeting that would make sense to shift to a blended format. You would access the included task list available as a Google Doc or a Word Doc, set up and assign tasks to your team members in your project management system. You would use the blended meeting template in either Mural or PDF to set up the async pre-work, sync time, and async post work of the meeting.
The last component of the Lead Placeless program are the optional project debriefs. These are synchronous workshop opportunities where groups of your leaders can join to discuss, reflect, and learn from one another about a specific project. When coming together for project debriefs, we recommend that all leaders who are participating in the session have previously completed that project, meaning that every leader would have executed the blended meetings project independently before joining the blended meeting project debrief. These typically happen three to four weeks after the initial lead placeless rollout. Overall, we recommend leaders allocate two to three hours over two weeks to complete the lead placeless e-course and invest at least 30 minutes with their first projects. The project debriefs take 90 minutes per workshop session. The Lead Placeless program is robust. It provides content and support resources within the toolkit, yet the program is specifically designed to be accessible for teams tight on time and can be taken in bites and stages that are manageable and deliver results to your team. The Lead Placeless content is created and curated based on years of research and evaluation to ensure that we deliver results for remote and hybrid teams. Therefore, we don't edit content to create custom courses for clients. We recommend you further the conversation with our sales team directly to understand your enterprise customization options. Thanks so much for watching. I hope I answered your questions as you're considering a virtual leadership training program. Please subscribe to our newsletter to stay connected on effectiveness in remote and hybrid teams.